What is up guys? I'm Daddy Gamer Fred and welcome back to another Super Mario 3D World Guide video. In today's video, we're gonna be doing World 1 Castle, which is the Bowser level, the very first Bowser level inside of Super Mario 3D World. Now I'm doing guide videos for all the levels. So again, if you're interested on watching guide videos for the level that you're looking for in particular, just search it. I probably did a video on it already. Let's jump into World 1 Bowser or Castle or whatever they want to call it. In order to get in, you need 10 green stars. Now, on this account, we already have 21 because we got in every green star in every level before this. And again, if you need guides on all of these levels on how to get them all green starred, just look at this playlist that this video is currently in. So let's jump and let's pay the 10 green stars and they don't take the stars away from you you just need to accumulate at least 10 in order to get in let's jump in and get three stars here as well as the stamp in this very first castle level now you do fight bowser in this level again bowser in this game basically a car boss battle most of the time so again is fairly easy there are other boss battles in this game but we're gonna go over those when we get to them now in order to beat this level 100 percent you are gonna need a cat outfit with you so we are gonna be picking up one of those there is a hidden block switch right here and that just gets you some, some coins now we're gonna see our first green star up here what you want to do is grab this and then collect all these little mini green coins and it will make a green star pop up right here. Now, quick little secret, there is a cat. Transformation bell right there so you can turn into the cat. And another hidden secret is that if you scale this wall, you get yourself 10 more seconds on the clock. I don't know why they hit that just one little 10 second up there, but for people who climb up there and jump up there, that's what you get for doing so. Now here you wanna like line yourself up in order to basically um, break those bricks out of there. It happened so fast, but break those bricks out of there. It's kind of easy. You just wanna like do it at an angle almost so you can break these wall right here so you can get inside and get this sticker for the level. Now. You might think it's yourself that you want to go this way, but actually what you want to do is with the cat suit, climb up here and hit this Paul switch that you actually need the cat suit to, to gain access to this part up here. And you actually need the cat suit to turn this wheel right here. If you don't have the cat suit at this point because you didn't get it out of that first question block, you can always go back and get it. And if you got hurt and you lost it for whatever reason, there is another one right here, right here. There it goes. Right here, you get another bell. Okay, so let's not get hit <laughs> and actually climb up here. Smack this a couple of times. Make sure it's all the way up where you can't smack it no more. Climb up as Cat Mario and then climb up again. Now you can get yourself a lot of coins right here and then you also can jump up here and grab yourself the second green star. You just jump straight down here. Just for covering everything that's in this level sake, there are three 10 timers right there, so you can add 30 more seconds to your clock. And then the green star, the last one is right here on top of this Goomba pyramid, so you grab yourself the last green star. And that's pretty much it. That's how you get all three green stars in the stickers inside of this level. Oh, yeah, I forgot. You can't hit the soccer balls with spikes on them. Now, you can break these fairly easy like that. With the soccer balls. It's not in these last two, I don't think so. But again, we actually got everything. We got the three green stars and we got the sticker. So we are ready to fight Bowser. Let's get on with the boss battle. I'm going to show you how to do this. It's very, very easy. It's literally just throwing soccer balls at Bowser. And at this stage, I'm not sure how many we got to hit him with. I believe it's three. I could be wrong. But you just basically hit Bowser's car with the soccer balls at any location. And he would take damage and just 
literally running at the soccer balls. Now, if the soccer ball is red with spikes out, you do not want to run at it because it will just hurt you. It will not give you, like, it won't do the, the bounce towards Bowser. You want to be careful because Bowser does have other attacks. He's not doing it right now. Weird. He has a fireball attack that he does. So he just spits out fire on the floor rather than throwing a soccer ball. So I think we gotta hit him three times, three times. So that would be nine soccer ball hits. So there we go, that was the second attack. Yes. Okay, but I was gonna relax, relax, relax. Let's play, let's play soccer. I missed both of those. Now, at the end of the road, Bowser will jump to another platform to get over there. Obviously, you just get inside the square, and it kind of just restarts the boss battle. Not his health-wise, but as far as, like, where you guys were in the track. And then there we go. Bowser is gone for now, and we are able to get to the flagpole to finish the level. It's going to drop a ton of coins. Recommend picking them up, especially if you need free mans, some extra lives you can grab yourself. A ton of free coins. Let's grab these and jump into the square. It's gonna take us here. It's gonna give us time to an extra hundred seconds on the clock to make sure that we are able to turn the flagpole gold. It's perfect. So we climb up here, grab these, grab up one ups. And then again, because we have the cat Mario, we are gonna turn this gold regardless because once you jump on there, he's gonna climb up real fast. But again, you can also do the long jump and touch the top like that if you do not have the cat Mario suit on. And that's gonna be it for this first level. This is world one slash castle. Very easy level. The stars, I believe stars two is actually the hidden one where you actually got to climb up all the way to the top with cat mario by turning the cat mario wheel whatever they want to call that once you do that you can get to the second star very easily but again this is how you complete it 100 percent touch the flagpole gold and unlock world 2 officially now do remember you can get past all of this if you just take the world pipe inside of the world one two i believe and that is the underground one where you can exit with the red pipe it skips all of this so if you are looking for a fast way to complete the game that is a the preferred method but if you're getting through 100 percent completing it again this is how you do it so let me know in the comment section below if you need any more tips on completing world one castle bowser's highway showdown let's have that conversation down there in the comments if you don't know and you're new around here i answer all comments so again let's have that conversation down there and if you are new consider hitting that subscribe button also hit the like button it does help me out a ton as far as moving the video into recommended so other people can check out the videos peace i love you guys i'm gonna see you guys on the next one thank you thank you thank you for making it to the end of this video if you're not a subscriber and you made it this far hit that subscribe button you know you want to join the family ring the bell so you can be notified on the next time i drop one of my videos as well as hit the like button on this video so it could be recommended so more people can check it out so we can have more people join in the family if you want to keep up with me on other social media platforms such as twitter instagram or tiktok or whatever i'm daddy gamer fred on all of those again daddy gamer fred you'll be able to find all those links in the description of this video and the pin tweet comment on my twitter also on all of my videos i do answer all comments so again if you just want to chat it up about the video or anything just hit me up in the comment section below i take time out of my day and literally answer to all the comments that you guys leave me and i love it and again let's have that conversation down there here are a couple of suggested videos that you guys should check out that may be of your interest i am a variety channel i do tons of stuff tons of pokemon but tons of other stuff as well so dive into these videos peace i love you guys i'm gonna see you guys on the next one